Still fans making their way through the turnstiles. They'll be just in time to catch the start of this game. Hi, folks. I'm Dan Stevens. And welcome to historic Lambeau Field. By my side is my colleague, Peter O'Keefe. Peter, who do you have your eye on? we get set to start this game. Well, at the moment, I'm watching the sidelines, and I know one guy who wants a win to start the season out right. Lovey Smith did a heck of a job as defensive coordinator and assistant head coach of the St. Louis Rams. Now in his first season as head coach of the Chicago Bears, Lovey will try to rejuvenate this team to its former greatness. We'll see how his game plan unfolds once we get started, but first, the toss of the coin. It's heads. Santo kicking off for the day. There's the signal, and we're it's ready. Time for Packer football. Santos boots the opening kickoff. Watson decides to take it out of the end zone. Drag down at the 17. A nice day for football. And ESPN Susie Culver will tell us if it will stay that way. Susie? Thanks, Dan. It's a beautiful temperate day. The conditions couldn't be better right now for a game of football. Dan? Susie, thank you. The Packers' offense will start this drive at their own 17-yard line. Jones goes Jones, right up the, the middle carrier. and gains about Number three yards. Three with the tackle. I'm Second and I'm six. Counter. Ball at the Packers' 20-yard line. Jones two yards picks up play. about two, and that brings up third down. Third down and four wideouts in the game. The Packers 22 yard line. Four receivers line up as the defense settles into a nickel package. Jones goes in motion. Jones didn't haul that one in, and it falls Jones incomplete. It'll receiver. be fourth down. Number 53 Jones positioned himself on the outside back there, but the ball didn't position itself in his hands. No catch. That seems to be an odd call, Peter. It fell incomplete, yeah, but even if they had caught it, they still would have been short of the first down. I don't like those calls either. Gotta get past the markers on those routes. It'll be fourth down. Number 16 lines up to punt after the three and out. Number 12 fields the punt at the 35. Tackled at the 38. Number 12 didn't have much room to work with back there. The special team squad made sure he couldn't respond to that really nice punt. First the Bears offense Chicago. will start this drive at their 38-yard line. Number 11 goes in motion. It past scrimmage and Montgomery gains about three yards. Number Montgomery is built like a attack. perfect back should be. 5'10, 222, low to the ground and broad shoulders. He's always ready to hit the holes his blockers make for him. Second down, Second three wideouts in the game. Ball of the Bears. 
Bears 41 yard line. It's intercepted. Intercepted at the 15. Takes time out of his busy schedule of smashing O lines to make the pickoff. Wow, he may be big, but if you're gonna throw that low, he's happy to take it from you. Boy, that was a heads up play to come away with his first interception of the game. Yeah, you gotta love D like that. The Packers are going to try and capitalize on the interception. They'll start this drive at the 15 yard line. Watkins goes in motion. Jones has his number called on first down and only gets back to the line of scrimmage. Thomas with the Thomas not only cleaned the ball carrier's clock in the backfield, but buffed and polished it too. Big hit for a loss. They put a stop to this play behind the line of scrimmage. Pretty good call by the defensive coordinator. Agreed, Dan. They, they had it all locked up. That will bring up second down. Rodgers rifles this one to the end zone and it's cut for the score. Watkins has a guy shadowing him, but still manages to make the catch. He beats his man Cole. It's all about staking your turf. He gets the touchdown, Peter, and that was a very nice play. Definitely. the point after and the extra point good. is good there's the signal and we're ready Number two kicks this one away. Moore catches it back at the four. Breaks three. Dragged down at the 26. Moore was able to find some weak spots in the defense. Got a good run back off that kick. Bears were intercepted last time out. We'll see what happens here. We'll start at their own 26-yard line. Number 80 goes in motion. there but it wasn't enough to stop him from making a catch not much there it'll be second down got to take what you can get Dan but they were you know hoping for more second down second nine, nine oh, yards to go there's 26 yard line <laughs> The completion is good for six. Fields, he's a good quarterback. First year man out of Ohio State and a nose for coming away with a big play when the chips are down. He's got this job for a reason. He's got the skills to pay the bills. Number 11 grabs the fastball over the middle, and they convert on third down. Number 11 down has there. nobody on him. The quarterback saw it and got the ball to him. What a First big play ten. on third down, oh, Peter. His run yards. after the catch is what made the play work. Yeah, Dan, you have to fight for those yards in that situation, and that's exactly what he did. 
Number 52 makes the sack just behind the line. Number 52 got the sack, but he was totally unblocked. You need to at least lay a hand on someone to slow him down a bit. They put a stop to this play behind the line of scrimmage. Pretty good call by the defensive coordinator. Agreed, Dan. They, they had it all locked up there. That will bring up second down. Second down, just a single receiver on the field. Montgomery loses one on the play, and that brings up third down. just planted the ball carrier in the turf short of the markers. But the only thing that's going to grow there is the D's morale. That's his second tackle so far. Gill lines up for the punt. Gill gets the ball and pummels this one deep. Fields the deep punt at the 15. Stop at the 17. Watson got pinned deep by a beauty of a kick there, and by the time he looked up, there was nowhere to go. The Packers will start this first play of the drive at their own 17-yard line. Watkins goes in motion. <laughs> His fourth carry of the game and will gain close to six. And that'll do it for That's quarter the number the one. The Packers are out in front, seven to nothing. Jones will get Jones stopped at the line, there. and that will bring up Thomas third down. With the tackle. Thomas was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. They don't let that play get back to the line of scrimmage, and that will bring up third down. Rodgers rifles this one hard over the middle. Complete for the first down and a whole lot more. First down with a split backfield. Thomas tackles him behind the line of scrimmage. Thomas, Thomas was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. Second and ten. Ball at the Packers' 44-yard line. Rodgers gets over his arm and just pass, and it's complete for a first down and a whole lot more. Second down, Second two wideouts on the field. All at the 34-yard line. Jones will get the carry on second down, and 
who moves forward for seven. Jones played smart and used his blockers to perfection on that last play. A decent play, and they'll now face third and short. That's the key, Dan. Make third down easy, and they did just that. Now third they just two. need to convert. We'll Ball see what they do. Taylor goes in motion. Jones gets the ball again, and he searches for a hole. Tackled at the 26. Number 97 was in on the tackle. That will bring up fourth down. Number 97 brought down the ball carrier before the markers. There was some gain there, but not enough for the first. The defense's back was against the wall, and they rose to the challenge, Peter. Yeah, Dan, that's great deep. They had to make a stand here, and they stood together. It will be fourth down. Squeezes it inside the right goal post. It's the field goal, but watch how close the ball gets to the upright. Man, a few more inches and he'd have made the highlight reel. Not the way he would have wanted to, though. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Number two, booms a beauty here. Number 12 decides to take it out of the end zone. Brought down at the 20. Number 12 got out close to the 20 on that one, so his decision to take it out of the end zone didn't really pay off, but it didn't really hurt him either. The Bears have had some trouble moving the ball recently. We'll see what they do on this drive as they start at their own 20 yard line. Jungle picks up a yard on the play and that will bring up second down. Montgomery used the blocking, but this stingy defense didn't give up much at all on that last play. Not much there, it'll be second down. Gotta take what you can get, Dan, but they were you know, hoping for more. Second down, tight end to the left. Number 86 goes in motion. No dice, and it falls incomplete. Montgomery had that ball in his hands on that play, and then he just dropped it. That's his first drop of the game, and while every drop does hurt, you can't throw too much blame on him for that. That would have been a tough catch. Fields throws a heater, and it is not reeled in. Incomplete. Alexander had superb coverage on that play. No wonder it was incomplete. Well, the knee holds tight on third and long and forces an incompletion. That was a good call by the defensive coordinator. Oh, it sure was. Perfect D for that situation. And it will bring up fourth down. Gill lines up to punt after the three and out. Gill takes the long snap and punts it away. Tackled at the 50. It looks like, uh, yeah, we've had an injury Good. down on the Good. field. As um, soon as we hear Good. anything, we'll be sure to pass the information right. along to you. You all right? You'll be all right? Check this out. You, 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 yeah, you see this good. right here? You, right? you feel this? You all right? I, I, it hurts. Right there, right there. Worry, just, oh, oh, you're going to be all right, man. You're going to be all right. Let me help you. Let me help you. Come on. Come on. You got to get come on. I need you gotta get back to us. Come on. Let's go. You going to be all right to play? The Packers come out on the field, and they're looking to extend their lead before halftime. 
They'll start at their 50-yard line. Rips him down in the backfield, and the clock continues to run. Jones has been battling the D, but the D is winning this one. Look at this. No real yards to speak of anywhere. Tough game. He's only got 19 yards on 10 carries. Second down Second with two tight ends to the right. Ball at the Packers, 49-yard line. Jones takes it for his 11th carry, and the Packers take their first time out. Third and eight. Ball at the 48-yard line. Rodgers lobs this one over the middle, and it's intercepted. Drag down at the 36. Well, it's all about getting in position to make the grab, and watch here. Oh, that's perfect position. Boy, that was a heads-up play to come away with his first interception of the game. Yeah, you got to love D like that. The Bears haven't got much out of their offense recently, and we'll see if they can get back on track here. This drive begins at their 36-yard line. continues to run. Number 52 gets a sack in the backfield. The quarterback had nowhere to go on this one. Let's watch. Yep, the D shut the offense down on that play. They couldn't do anything. Peter, he's really gotten after the quarterback in this game. Oh, you could say that again. So far, he's got three tackles and two sacks. <laughs> Fields, zings it to the right side, and it's intercepted. And he's in for the touchdown. Alexander takes off the ball, and he's going all the way. Nobody can stop him. Man, I hope his mom's got the VCR going. Well, that's their second interception of the game, and uh, Stingy is appearing to be the motto for their defense. Yeah, either that or give me the ball. Here's the extra point, and the extra it's point good. is good. Who's a beauty here? Number 12 decides to take it out of the end zone. Brought down at the 21. Number 12 got out close to the 20 on that one, so his decision to take it out of the end zone didn't really pay off, but it didn't really hurt him either. The Bears need to score here before half to have a chance later. They'll start at their own 21-yard line. Montgomery gets the call on first down and rambles for about five. Stokes had to leave the field earlier in the game, and now Susie Calber has a report. Susie? Thank you, Dan. I got in touch with the team doctor, and apparently he's suffering from a sprained elbow. They're putting a brace on him, but it's taking longer than they expected. It's unclear whether he'll be able to get back into this one. Dan, back to you. As always, we'll hope for the best up here in the field. Thank you, Susan. Montgomery will get stopped at the line, and that brings up third down. 
And that'll do it for the first the half the of this quarter. one. The Packers in command of this one, 17 to nothing. And now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Boomer? All right, Dan, we'll get back to you in a bit. But welcome, everybody, to the ESPN Halftime Show. I'm Chris Berman. A look at our halftime stats here, and boy, look at the difference in passing yards. The Bears are certainly losing because of it. It's hard to win when you play like that. Let's get started in this one early in the first quarter. Number 96 shows some great awareness here as he gets himself into position to pick this one off. The Packers midway through the first, already inside field goal range. Rodgers would find his target on this one. A 15-yard touchdown for the Packers. The Packers midway through the second, Packers leading by seven. Number two is summoned for the field goal attempt. Good snap, good spot, good kick. Three goods equals three points. They move ahead by 10. The Packers again have it. Number 53 was in the right place at the right time as his interception was a possible momentum shifter. Packers ahead, 10 to nothing. Alexander would come up with a huge play here as he was able to pick one off here, then had some clear sailing in front of him. Touchdown for the Packers. And that's where we'll leave this one. Packers are up at the half, 17 to nothing. And as far as my halftime hero, well, there's really no contest. Alexander has taken over this game. And now let's return to the second half with Dan Stevens and Peter O'Keefe. Thanks, Chris. And today's game has been presented in ESPN Game Sound, designed and developed in collaboration with Dolby, the leader in surround sound technology. The Bears will get the ball first here in the second half, and they are going to need a bunch of scores to get back into this Number one. Two, kicking Currently, off the they're down 17 to nothing. Now, let's get to the game. Moore decides to take it out of the end zone. Stop at the 18. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. Well, the turnover column has the grim news, in my opinion. If you want to win, you have to hold on to the ball. Let's go down to Susie Culber, who has an update for us. Susie? Thanks, Dan. Head coach Lovey Smith clearly was first upset ten, about ten, his team's Chicago. performance in the first half. He said, this is not the way we hope to start this game. Offensively, we just haven't been getting it done. It's a gut check. We want this win. We've got to come out and play a lot harder and a lot smarter in the second half. Back to you, fellas. Thanks, Susie. Campbell penetrates and stomps that pack at the 17. Takes a play on this and forces the incompletion. Fields really struggling out there today. As you can see by the numbers, it's all bad. Up to now, he's got 13 yards and two interceptions. Campbell tackled him so close to the markers he can probably taste it and along with the dirt and the grass he's trying to spit out. That's his third tackle of the game. Gill lines up for the punt. Gill gets the ball and punts it away. Watson fields the punt at the 30. Tackled at the 40. 
Watson racked up a few yards on the run back there, whittling down the size of the punt a little bit. Stalled early last drive, and we'll have to wait and see what happens here. They'll start at the 40-yard line. Jones carries this off his left tackle and picks up a couple. Adam, all right, what have you got? Okay, all right. Second and seven. Ball at the Packers' 42-yard line. Jones grabs the rope right side and picks up maybe a yard. Number 53 with the tackle. Third down, empty backfield. Ball at the Packers, 42-yard line. Rodgers fires this one over the middle, and the catch is made well past the markers for a first down. Watson faces down two defenders and comes away with the football. Oh, nice catch. Third and long, and they get the big play to convert. What do you think of that, Peter? I love it. That's what football is all about, making the big plays when you need to, and you can't coach that. Watkins goes in motion. Jones will take the hand off. Is the line popped hard at the 41. Jones has been searching for a rhythm out there, Dan, and he's coming up short. It seems like his timing is way off. He's working hard, but only has 26 yards on 13 carries. Second and eight. Ball at the 41. Jones loses about three, and that will bring up third down. Thomas not only cleaned the ball carrier's clock in the backfield, but Buffed and polished it, too. Big hit for a loss. Peter, he's been lining up the defensive side of the ball today and getting some nice numbers out of it. You bet. So far, he's got five tackles. Number 13 didn't haul that one in, and it falls incomplete. It'll be fourth down. Number 20 with the Number 13 didn't have anybody on him, and yet he couldn't make the catch. Peter, in third down situations, they have not been successful at all with the pass. This play Number was 12. more proof. The Boy, third is such a crucial down, Dan. And when you don't convert, it really hurts. Number 16 takes the long snap and takes it away. Tackled at the 14. Number 12 didn't get very far running that ball back, but on the bright side, the kick was pretty lackluster, so his offense gets pretty good field position anyway. The Bears have a long Chicago. field ahead of them and start this drive back at their own 14-yard line. Number 35 goes in motion. Campbell with the tackle. Second down with the tight end right. Ball at the Bears 14 yard line. Unloads this to the right sideline and 
It's off. Incomplete. Number 13. Has that one come right to him back there. You have to catch those passes, baby. That would have gotten the first, but it's incomplete, and it will be third down. Complete. That will bring up fourth down. Number 13 looked like he had a solid catch there, and yet somehow he found a way to drop it. That's the third incompletion his way, Peter. Yeah, and he's starting to look a little frustrated down there, too. Hill lines up deep in his own territory to punt it away. Gill takes the snap and punts it away. Watson feels the punt at the 45. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. They turned the ball over, but they have survived their mistakes. But you can't survive that kind of sloppy play for long. It's going to come back to bite you. Offense takes the field, and they have good field position again. They will start at the 45-yard line. Jones picks up about two, and that brings up second down. Second and seven. Ball at the 43. Rodgers sends it to the left sideline, and the reception is made past the markers for a first down. Rodgers lived dangerously on that play with a pass into double coverage, but the throw was on target. What a pass. Nice pass, Peter, and he's really lighting up the stat sheet. Oh, you've got it so far. He's got 84 yards and one touchdown. Jones, Jones takes this one way out left and gains about three yards. Now we're going to get it this time. Now we're going to go just like it is. We're going to execute, and we're going to stay strong, and we're going to get to the spots we need to. Okay, fellas? And that'll do it for the third That's quarter. The, the, the Packers quarter. in command of this one, 17 to nothing. Second down, one man down. for about five. Here comes the run. Third and two. Ball up to 23. Larry, Larry, Larry. Throwing down. Throwing down. Black KG. Black KG. Field, and that takes them even farther away from the markers. Fourth down coming up. Number 53 targeted the ball carrier early and Number didn't two, even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. Ten. He's got seven Number tackles so far. Holding. Fourth down, three yards to go. <laughs> Number two with the 42-yard attempt, and he misses this one way off to the left. Number two mops a kick here that's not a shorty, but isn't that long either. Oh, that has got to rattle him. Ah, oh, poor guy. I think what he really needs is a big hug. Yeah, maybe a new foot. <laughs> if he's not careful, a new jersey. 
Bears send their offense out on the field and will start this drive at their 33-yard line. Number 85 didn't Passes haul that one in, and it falls Number incomplete. Was the intended receiver? Number 25 with the coach. Fields has had difficulties to say the least, and now he's second guessing everything he's throwing. Terrible day. So far, he's struggled to get 23 yards and two interceptions. They're going air. They're Second going and air. 10. Ball at the Bears' 33-yard line. Fields throws a lob right sideline and it's incomplete. All day, baby. All day. You ain't getting nothing. Four wideouts in the game. First down, Bears. Fields floats it to the right side and it's intercepted. Tackled at the 42. Fields is feeling some pressure as he lets this one go. Which is why it zings right into the defender's reach. He wishes he had that one back. Another throw that was picked off, and this game is turning into a nightmare for him. Well, he better wake up. The Packers offense takes the field. They're in command, and they'll probably look to take time off the clock. They will start at their 42-yard line. Jones got the carry on first down and Jones, maybe carrier. picks up one on Number the play. With the tackle. Second and nine. Ball at the Packers' 43-yard line. Jones gains three yards, and that brings up third down. Third down, three wideouts in the game. Ball at the Packers, 46-yard line. Made the save, dropping the ball carrier before he could get to the markers. And I'll tell you what, this looks like it wasn't that difficult to tackle, but he had his hands full. Yeah, looks can be deceiving, Dan. He really had to square himself perfectly to make that play. Number 16 lines up to punt after the three and out. Number 16 gets the snap and punts it away. Number 12 takes it at the 10. 
Tackled at Almost the 19. Point. Number 12, racked up a few yards on the run back there, whittling down the size of the punt a little bit. The Bears will start this drive deep in their own territory with the clock at 1.52. Snags the missile. The Bears take their first time out. First down, the first clock is stopped at 147. 32 yard line. Fields makes the pass and it's knocked down at the line incomplete. Number 93 swatted that pass away right at the line. Potential for some nice yards, but the defense plays it tough. That will bring up second down second down one man down ball of the bears 32 yard line intercepted down at the 39 Douglas does a nice job picking off the pass there. He's got it, and he gets a little more with that nice little run back. Yet another interception for this defense, and they're making passing just about impossible so far. Absolutely. Great reads, great jumps on the ball, great athletes. It's all happening down there. The Packers start this drive in great field position at the 39-yard line. <laughs> Number 28, the Bears will take a timeout. That's their second. Second down, six. just a single receiver Ball on the, the field. Six yard line. <laughs> Number 28 takes it. The Bears ball. take a timeout. That's their final one. Third down, the clock is stopped at 127. Number 28 gets the toss and gets past the line. Tackle, and the clock will continue to run. First down. Second and 11. Ball at the 19. Down! Set! Blue 56! Blue 56! And that 
is going to do it for this one. The Packers come out on top 17 to nothing. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying goodbye until next time. Good job, baby. Good job. All right, Dan, thank you. So this one is in the books as we welcome you all to our ESPN video games post-game show. I'm Chris Berman. The Packers stepped it up for sure, putting up some good numbers. Let's get started in this one early in the third quarter. Roger connected with his man on this one. The Bears, after a missed field goal, Alexander shows some great awareness here as he gets himself into position to pick this one off. Bears losing by 17. Douglas was in the right place at the right time, as his interception was a possible momentum shifter. The Packers have it off an interception. Number 28 let his big old offensive line pave the way on this one. And that's where we'll leave this one. Packers serve up a shutout, 17 to nothing. Now let's take a sec to chat with our player of the game. Guy who seemed to be all over the field on defense and came up with big play after big play. Alexander is standing by with Susie Culver. Suze? Thanks, Chris. You showed your medal. You just made it look easy tonight. What put you guys over the top? You know what it is? It's about defense. Our D line came up big today. They were making tackles and putting pressure in the pocket. I'm proud of them. That's how we do it. Chris, back to you. That winds up our broadcast of the NFL preseason on ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports for 25 years and counting. I'm Chris Berman. Thanks for joining us.